Hi guys, I'm Big Mac. I'm Paul Fry. And I'm Sunday. And, and we're, we're Poos Foods. And we're here at the Epcot International Flower and Garden Festival of 2019. We're gonna look around, see the topiaries, check out the food booths. Follow us, we're gonna take it around. Yeah. And... Alright, let's go. Yep. Don't forget to fill your content, like and subscribe. Alright, we got some of the festival merchandise. I haven't seen all of it yet, but we're still gonna keep looking. Lemon stress ball. Lemon stress balls. But it does not smell lemony, I'm disappointed. I like this figment shirt. Lemonade ears. We're having jacket issues. All right, I'm back. I'm back. We're at the Honey Bee Stroll. So what do we got here? What's that? I don't know. You have the book. I have the book. You have the book. Of I didn't you look in the book. Okay, All right, we got no roasted book. cauliflower with buckwheat, honey carrot puree, wild rice pilaf, asparagus, honey blistered grapes, sunflower brittle, and coriander flowers. It looks nice. Gross. Take us to the next one. What do we got right here? Um, a honey right tandoori here? chicken flatbread with white cheddar cheese, charred vegetables, clover honey sour cream, and micro citrus greens. That sounds beautiful. Yeah. All right. What's this? Finally, we got local wildflower honey marscapone cheesecake with orange blossom honey ice cream garnished with fennel, pollen, meringue kisses, and petite lavender shoots. Yeah. Let's lavender start with the shoots. cauliflower. Get it out of the way. It's going to be grossed out. Mm-hmm. Get the scrape. It looks good. Ah. Uh, Get a little uh, bit of cauliflower and some rice and some of this sauce stuff. Where's the cauliflower go? Yeah. Cold and icky. Cold and icky. Valid description. Yeah. All right. Yep. I'm not saying it's not icky, but let's face it. You three are not vegetarians. Somebody who's a, yep. you would need to think about it from their perspective. I eat vegetarian dishes. Which yeah. is still gross. Even vegetarians mm. wouldn't like this. Wow. It's, it's garbage for everyone. The rice yep. is like chewy. Unless you like it is like cauliflower. cauliflower. Everything is cold. You like all the oh that's good products? Well, it's you a like salad, this. right? So it should be cold. No, it's roasted cauliflower and wild rice pilaf. It should be hot. This oh. asparagus was yeah. good. There you go. Well, why would it be hot if there's grapes on it? So maybe it's supposed to be cold. Maybe. I don't know. I'm not impressed yeah. either. I don't know. It, it was sitting under a heat lamp, and yeah. we got the last one. So who knows? The puree is okay. I'm trying this flat. Definitely tastes like carrots. That was also sitting under a heat lamp. Cut the flat bread. Mm. I mean, there's only like two pieces of chicken, so... Yeah, but it's warm at least. I don't know how I'm supposed to cut it. Either that or just take a bite, and I'll take another bite. But what if you don't get any chicken? Want you to do half mine? Sure. All right, we're sharing. We're sharing the flat bread. I like the flavors. Tomato's nice. Enjoying that sour cream. Um... It could be hotter, but also we had to wait a minute at the window because the cheesecakes weren't ready. So, you know, pros and cons. I don't like it. 
I like the honey sour cream though. Honey sour cream is kind of bitter. It is. It is a bit bitter. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's kind of bitter, but besides that, I like I'd the place. It's pretty good, but I like bitter stuff. Like I love olives, so things like that. Bitter profiles. I'm gonna keep eating it because I'm hungry. Yeah. Like Let's do the cheesecake. The cheesecake. Do, 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 do. Yeah, We've had this in the past. Cake. Food food video, and it was wonderful. So we did it again. Cause why not? Yeah. Well, they did change it up a little. Still delicious. Mm. Heavy like honey profile from the ice cream and the cheesecake itself. Just really good. Mm. The sauce on the top. Yes. Make it firm. It did not change. It is still delicious. Mm. No, it is. It's a little different. They're it is different. different. But it's but still. Still, mm. it's still excellent. Wow, that's so good. Actual quality really did good. not change. Yeah. It's so, very cool, creamy, and rich. Yeah. It's so nice. The, the honey taste isn't overwhelming. This, no. Like, I'm kind of iffy on honey sometimes. Like, sometimes I'm like, yeah, this is nice. Sometimes I'm like, no, thank you. But it's, it's lovely. <laughs> it's got just the right amount. Well, that disc that was on top of the cheesecake yeah. was... Was it honey-rific? It was all honey. And I like honey, so I can tell you, mm, that was delicious. I'm gonna eat. You don't need any more of it. So that's it at the Honey Man. Bistro. Oh, also, I got a beer. This yeah, is a brandy barrel aged honey beer from Kentucky. Can you believe that he got a beer? I know. Don't use I know. Very out of character. <laughs> oh, it's delicious. It's delicious. I'm not like six heavy, of them. heavy overtones of honey and like or I'll break little uh, and like notes of the brandy. That's really good. Uh, Big Mac, you're forgetting to tell our viewers about something. What am I forgetting? It's I on your wrist. Thing. Oh, gift cards. So I have new festival gift cards. But the great thing about these, you see this little piece of paper here? It's full of seeds. If you plant it, it's going to grow wildflowers. That's fun. Interesting stuff. You can get it. From what we've seen, it's an orange or a strawberry is all we saw, yeah, right? Yeah, we haven't seen any Just oranges and strawberries. The strawberry man is covered. By the way, guys, once again, since we forgot to say it in the intro... Follow us on Instagram. Instagram. Got Instagram exclusives. Find us at Poots Foods. Yeah. Yeah. At Poots. Hold on. He's looking at Spooky Empire advertising. Yeah, just Poots Foods. Yeah. yeah. At, at Poots Foods. Foods. Oh, and don't you have a new welcome to send out too there, Big Mac? Oh, yeah. We have a couple new subscribers. We don't get to see everyone because some subscriptions are set to private. We do have a new subscriber. named name is Nami Watanabe. Welcome to the Poots Foods family. Yeah. And, yeah. And for those of you who are not prop public. If you would like your name to be mentioned, just leave it in the comments. Yeah. We'll put you in our next video. We can do it. All right. We can do it. Some maybe. I don't know. On to the next. All right. Let's go to the next booth. Hi. For the best. It's the maple griddle thingy. We'll be fine if there's no popcorn on it. So here we are with uncomfortable popcorn. This popcorn just looks unnatural. And I'm not sorry. What's on this poutine? I don't remember. It's like a fire corn relish and cheese curds and, and beef brisket. Meat. Alright, let's go. Gravy. Alright, let's Don't do the thing. Yeah. It's got that been good going. Shit. Yeah. Alright, <laughs> right, we're it's at got the same that table. Good shit. But we went to the refreshing port and Northern Bloom at Canada. We have a poutine, it's a like coffee braised pork, gravy, cheese curds, mm. peppery corn, a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff on there. It's really good. Mm. It's delicious. Yeah, the corn is, is yummy. Mm. The beef is yummy. Delicious. I still don't eat beef in case anyone is wondering. But I mean, it's now already been purchased, and I might as well not waste it. Is that your excuse? I don't want the cow to be sacrificed in vain. It's delicious. The fact that you think it tastes amazing has nothing to do with it? Just because I don't eat it doesn't mean I don't think it's delicious. I didn't stop eating beef because I thought it was gross. 
Big Mac. Mm. You can taste your coffee. It's savory. A lot of nice flavors. It could use more cheese curds. Yeah. But other than that, I'm really happy with this. So I don't like coffee, and I don't know the coffee tastes at all. I just think it's really savory and delicious. delicious. Yeah, this is tasty. Mm -hmm. I would highly recommend it. It was what, 8.50? Uh, it's a big nine portion. Something. 9.05, I think, was the total. But probably like including after the tax. tax. All right, what else we got here? Right. We got whatever this is, where I've been eyeing that orange thing. I think orange it's like a carrot. sweet potato. Carrot. It's a carrot. That orange thing. eyeing it for forever. I want to eat it. So or eat it. Or a pickled dog wiener. Pickled dog wiener. All right, so we got beef tenderloin <laughs> tips with mushroom bordelais sauce, whipped potatoes, and garden vegetables. What do we got there? Um, some seared scallops with French green beans, butter potatoes, brown butter vinaigrette, and applewood smoked bacon. All right, and finally, we have the griddled maple pound cake with warm peach compote and sweet corn gelato. It looks delicious, except for the disturbing Uncomfortable popcorn. popcorn. Yeah. Except for the uncomfortable popcorn. Give me some of this. I'm going to eat some beef. I'm gonna eat the carrot first. This carrot. Mmm. That's very good. Very good. Trying to get this little onion. That's a nice carrot. Mmm. Pretty good carrot. That's delicious. It's got so much flavor. It's tender. I love that Bordelais sauce. Mm -hmm. Garden veggies are nice. Mm -hmm. The mashed potatoes are really smooth and. Fluffy. No. Definitely a thumbs up on that one. Mm -hmm. I some love it. That's delicious. What do you think? I love it. He loves it. All right, let's go. I don't like scallops, but I will eat some green beans and this little potato here. I'll eat some scallops. I like scallops. If I can get it. I got the potato. There we go. I got a green bean. Scallops good. A bit of a lemony flavor to it. Yeah. Cooked really well. Lemon. Yeah, I like it. The you only have two are, though. Potatoes are cooked really well. They're super soft, and the yeah. green beans are crispy. Yeah, I'm liking those beans. It has an interesting flavor. So yeah, it's very different. Yes. It's far out, bro. Bro. Far out. Yeah. Far out. Okay. I had this last year. I don't think we did it in our video, but I remember I wanted to try it. And last year, it was a mushy, goopy mess. Well, I'm excited for this mushy. And I just, I just tried this one, way better. And wow, I think, I think it's great. Oh yeah, it's, it's get, the texture seems fantastic. It. Yeah, it's holding together really well, but also coming apart. Slice pork. it. You slice that fruit. Show me, boss. Oh yeah. Thing, but I sliced the fruit. You don't need any of that. Excuse no, me. No, 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 no. <laughs> Excuse me. You're good where you are. Oops. Dropping everything. No, I don't want the popcorn. Ah, oh, stay away from me. There you go. Got oh. The pound cake itself okay, has got a similar now. flavor profile to like, like honey, like honeycomb, like cereal. Wow. Um, I'm having any of the peach yet. Peach is delicious. Peach is delicious. Looks delicious. delicious. Want to get some popcorn? This is really lovely. Oh yeah, totally. Mm. I love the peaches. I'm gonna try this. Oh, the popcorn has that savoriness, like to offset all the ice sweet. Cream by itself. Yeah, I'm liking this a lot. Yeah. For a gelato or whatever that's supposed to be flavored like corn, it is very good. Yeah. Stop giving me so much ice cream. I don't know about you, but when you see something that's like a corn ice cream, it might be like, ew, but it's really good. It's like really creamy with just a little bit of sweetness. It's very good. Yeah, this is really nice. Very nice. Get some more of this peach. And I got more beer. Whoa. Oh my gosh, who would have seen that coming? Blowing minds. Oh, you better watch out. Your cam camera lady's going to fall over from shock. Yeah. This is the Unibrew Lune de Miel. It's a oh, I'm so startled. That's bizarre. I am so <laughs> startled. <laughs> right, I know you don't like it. Try this. I don't want to try it. We'll try it. It's going to taste gross. It, it probably will to you, but I'm trying to figure out what that flavor is. How do you think explosion. I would know? 
of I'm like just floral think, notes. I'm just gonna think it tastes like hops. No, it doesn't taste like hops at all. Give it a try. It's like really floral. He says this about a lot of things, and then suddenly it sucks. All right, the camera will try it. Try the beer. Someone else has got to try this beer. You're f effing <laughs> trying this beer now, young lady. It has like such a heavy, like floral flavor. Oh my god, she didn't make. She didn't get jarred. It's weird. By I the don't taste. know what it is, but it has this like. Kind of like. Uh, like Small fries in. turn. <laughs> you done been told. Now that she drank it. <laughs> I really like it. I think it's very different. <laughs> yeah, it's really bad, isn't it? Ha ha ha. I enjoy it. I Got you. It. <laughs> it was lies and trickery. <laughs> <laughs> She's very unhappy. It's <laughs> disgusting. I don't like beer. <laughs> she right. doesn't. Hey. That's it for us. Got uh, a joke for you, because you're... What the stamp say to the envelope? I don't know what. Stick with me and we'll go places. Well, stick with us and you'll go all around the world. <laughs> Showcase. Showcase. <laughs> all right, we'll be back in the next booth. I made it sound more fun. <laughs> all right, so just tell me how many you want. All right, guys, we went to the Citrus Blossom. You might recognize the surroundings. We're still at the same table. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> hey, um, so, it's quiet back here. <laughs> Alright, I got an issue. So this is a lobster tail with lemon emulsion and grilled lemon. Ooh. Here's my problem. Not only is it part of half of a lobster tail, it looks like the roadkill of the sea. It does not look appetizing. Looks I hope like, it tastes better Looks like than when it you looks. find a roach in your closet that's stuck on its back and just dead and shriveled. <laughs> yeah, that's what it looks like, actually, to be honest. <laughs> uh, what do we have here? Uh, yeah, I don't know. Some yeah, right chicken there. bullshit. Crispy citrus chicken with orange aioli and baby greens. And what do we have there? Uh, we got a dish uh, yeah, a dish the sponge. citrus shortcake. Orange chiffon cake, lemon curd mandarin, whipped cream, citrus caramel, and apple cider sorbet. And let's not forget! Oh yeah. Oh, the orange, orange bird. bird. Yeah. He's got a orange, orange cream slushy in it. Yeah. And a souvenir orange bird sipper cup. He's, He's like, non alcoholic. He's yeah. like my fourth favorite character. Yeah, give me Sticks. that back. It's like drinking a creamsicle. So, it's amazing. I think he's why you go to this booth because I don't know about this food, but let's give it a try. Yeah, yeah. I, I think we've had something like that before and I don't think it when was I, good. When I looked at the descriptions, I was like, man, this stuff sounds good. And now it's in front of me and I'm like... Ugh. Well, the tail peels right out. I guess we're just going to eat it off the stick. I don't want that. Eat it off the stick. I'll wait. As isn't you guys, isn't Sunday getting some of that? Yes, I shall have some, because if you remember, I did like lobster and from that other booth, that other festival. Unless it's your friend. That's nasty. <laughs> that is straight up nasty. Yeah, nasty? Oh, I'm good. no. <laughs> your, your thoughts, Sunday? <laughs> oh, I can smell it now. Mm, good fish yeah. doesn't smell like that. Ooh. Keep your lobsters. We don't want you spreading them. All right, um, I'm going to eat some of this chicken. Right. Get out of my orange bird. I'm going to steal some of her orange bird. I don't know what the greens are on top. Zucchini, maybe? Cucumber? I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to eat it. Also, I have a coconut key lime ale, and guess what? Mmm, really yummy. It tastes like coconut and key lime. It's delicious. All right, I mean... Camera lady didn't lie to you. It's pretty good. I'm just going to take all of it. really yummy. The chicken is warm. Breathe out through your nose and you sip it. Like, the notes really come out. Okay, I don't like it, but that's because I don't like beer. But all the flavors that it says are there, are there. there. Really tasty stuff. Especially the coconut. Yeah. That's actually good. So much better. If you're going to get a, any food food here, get the chicken. It's good. Even that I wouldn't mm. recommend, though. I didn't think it's tasty. I'm not saying it's bad, but I'm, there are better options already. I don't know. I like that chicken. I love that, like, citrusy zest mm -hmm. on there. That's yeah, nice. Good. I'm liking the chicken. Now we're gonna have some of this dish sponge cake. <laughs> yes. Dish sponge. Mm. Again, same as the maple pound cake. You see this? Like perfect. You can just take it off in one big solid piece. Oh my floor. god, it's so light. Yeah. 
looks really good. And citrusy. Mm. I mean, it doesn't mm. look good from the outside. From the outside, it looks like a dish lunch. Mm. Yeah. Light, fluffy, citrusy. It's really nice. Oh, holy cow. It's a bit of crunch to it. Delicious. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's delicious. I love that cake. Really, really good. I expected it to be very... I don't know the word I'm looking for. Um, <coughs> I guess light. Oh. I guess I didn't expect it to be like a really strong flavor profile, but I ate it and it was like an orange punched me in the face. Yes. And I liked it. But yeah. <laughs> it was a good punch. Yeah. 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 This stuff was delicious. Yeah. Not the lobster. They Ooh. may throw that in the trash. Yeah. <laughs> Keep the lobster. Horrendous presentation. Horrible taste. I think it used to be hot. It's kind of cold now. I'm not a fan. They also have a tuna, tuna tatiki. Is that tataki. right? Tataki. Yes. But it is spicy. So small fry, you know, as she says, the white girl don't touch the spice. And it's full of avocado. <laughs> so with the allergies <laughs> from other people. And I don't really like spicy food either. That kind of took care of that. So. Yeah. Alrighty. Yep. Yeah. We are going to move on. And we promise Next one we're going to be at a new table. table. Maybe. We hope. Maybe. Maybe we'll just move into this table. I'll <laughs> set up a tent. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We'll be here overnight. You'll know that we're here because we're going to put a sign up that says food's food on the outside of our tent. Yeah. Come visit us. Yes. We'll, we'll do an <laughs> overnight live stream. Very <laughs> funny. All right. <laughs> Let's go. All right. We have got the Key Lime Funnel Cakes. There's this funnel cake booth right in the American Pavilion, and their special funnel cake right now is a Key Lime Pie Funnel Cake. Yeah. It's delicious. This giant slab of like Key, key lime, lime Pie ice cream. Yeah. 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 I like the forks. The forks like are yeah, translucent. Yeah, we decided that they're for a rave. You can't get any funnel cake. No cake for you. Apparently not. There we go. Hmm. break apart. Yes, yeah. and make sure eating this with like 10 people because this is diabetes on the plate. <laughs> I mean, it's unhealthy, but I need it all. And we we'll get diabetes. Small fry, as long as we're here and probably getting sued by Journey. Uh, <laughs> what was this that you had, had to drink? Ichigo Sun from over here at Hanami. And it is a sake drink with lemonade and strawberry puree. And, and it's delightful. Yours, Big Mac? I can see it's... It's a Nigori sake? I believe it's called Little Lily. It's good. It is good. Not the best Nigori I've had, but it's really tasty. Alrighty. We put them on Instagram. We did. Sure did. Alrighty. Yeah. We'll be back after we finish some funnel cake. Yum. We found more flower and garden merchandise. Oh wow. I think that's a belt. Is there a belt? Is that old Nabla on there? I can't find the price. Yeah, it's a belt. I don't know. We're just gonna guess on that one. Oh, 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 oh. Found it. Found it. Here we go. I feel like it's a belt. I don't know how old are in now. I think so. Wow. $64.99. Got mugs. I believe this is a brand name service. Yes, it is. It's made in America. Alright guys, that is it here for us tonight at the Flower and Garden Festival 2019. It's only a first day here. We will be back in a week. 
Tonight, however. Two weeks. Two weeks. Uh, one day. Someday we'll return. Maybe never. Tonight, we've got reservations for Artist Point at Wilderness Lodge, the Snow White Character Dining. And, and they were hard to get. They were very hard to get, but we got it. So that's where we're heading now. So what was your favorite food item? Well, the honey bistro cheesecake was really good. It was pretty tasty. Um, how about you, Sunday? Mine's a toss-up between that funnel cake because I really like sour foods as well as dessert. And the other of my favorite items, probably that beef. Yeah. What on the? Uh... The beef with the uh, mashed potatoes. And the... Oh, okay. Yeah. From. Yeah, that place. My favorite was the lobster. <laughs> <laughs> that SpongeBob ran over with his with yeah, his, uh, with his boat. <laughs> that was that gets the worst item of the year, let alone yeah. day. It's the nastiest thing I put in my mouth for a long time. It was so awful. Man, it even looked terrible. bad when it got there. Yeah, it looked terrible. Roadkill of the sea. So nasty. Definitely. Um, I really love the poutine from the refreshment port. That was really great. That was really good. Um, the chicken. At the uh, citrus the blossom, the citrus blossom it was delicious. It was really great. I love that. Um, yeah, I don't know. I think my favorite is the poutine. I like that poutine. It's pretty tasty. Lots of good stuff. Yeah. Yeah, and all the alcohol was good. Just you know. So basically. Yeah, yet some more. Basically. Oh, guys. and they missed the Pirates of the China Sea, but maybe we'll get that next time. That next video. I'll have it Probably. again. It's good. Uh, anyway. Big Mac. I mean, ask you, what are your thoughts on a couple of the countries and the same old, so, same old? Some of the booths have the same food they've had for literally years, and I really wish they would update them, because food in Morocco is not great, and it's been around forever. All right, guys. Yeah. Let's... Yeah. So, basically what we're telling you, as you could probably have gathered from this video and previous videos at these festivals, at these festivals, you will order the food, and sometimes you'll find something really good. Like, you know, that poutine. And other times you'll get a butt sandwich or a butt cake. <laughs> butt cake? Butt cake. Or that lobster. <laughs> butt lobster. <laughs> and we, are, we already discussed this. SpongeBob ran it over. Then Squidward came over and stomped on it a few times. SpongeBob can't drive. <laughs> exactly. That's why he ran over a lobster. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's about it? Are we heading on? Bye, we're going to much. dinner. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you much for watching. Like and subscribe. Follow your dreams. We'll see you in the next bite. Which is soon. Bye. <laughs>